Let me know how the audio is. Seven-ish months ago. Yup, that's me. I've been learning boxing recently. And aside from the brain damage, it's, it's going pretty good. I've been a little slow to pick it up, maybe on account of, of all the brain damage, but we have more important questions to ask. Like, where am I? Why am I learning to I'll box? I'll do Leslie's vlog after this. A couple months ago, iDubs asked me if I wanted to be part of this boxing tournament thing called Crater Clash. No! Crater no, Clash. Is what I thought in my head. But for a second, the surrealness of the situation overwhelmed me. I've been watching iDubs since I was in, like, middle school, and he was asking me to do a boxing tournament it may as well have been a, like a mass hallucination <laughs> Thank you, Obi. for all i was aware and I, I i just said yes so i'm uh guess i'm doing it uh the only problem is i am really 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 bad at boxing so don't know what i'm gonna do about that building a boxing robot to help me train for my fight not sure what that means yet i hope the next part is quick is i couldn't read the it's rest called a tens unit it's meant to treat like pain in old people but if you crank it all the way up it makes you involuntarily flex whatever muscles it's attached to. So let me show you how we're going to use it. If you look, a single tens unit can't do much. It that transition. Really one muscle at a time. But if I strap a whole bunch of them to different arm muscles and activate them at just the right times, it will force me to punch so I can train for my boxing match without even thinking about it. So first, we got to figure out how to control these guys with the computer. Because the way it normally works is you twist these little tens unit uh, nipples with your fingers. But we can't just have someone standing here doing that the whole time. So let's take it apart and see quick. how it works. I'm too it quick. turns out that what's under the dials is not nipples, but potentiometers, the nipples of electronics. The way these guys work is they limit the flow of electricity low? going through them based on how much you turn this little dial. It's kind of like a, like a sink. The more you turn the faucet on, the more electrons can flow through the pipes. Now you might be wondering how that potentiometer works with the rest of the circuit as a whole. I don't fucking know. Lily is so lucky. I'll have you know, they are both lucky. And it breaks my brain that they don't want kids because I feel like they would have the most talented children in the world. Have babies! Are you kidding me? They would have the most talented and genius. Their kids would be genius. Fuck! Why? Engineering? I didn't go to school for anything. That's what Like, it's like... I feel like... Really cool, really cool, talented people should just make a lot of babies. Sorry, I did have too much caffeine. I'm sorry. This guy comes in. This is a digital potentiometer. It does the same thing a potentiometer does, but you can control it with code. And bing bang boom, now we should be able I have to no idea what this guy's talking about. Bitty piece of software that just says to turn the resistance way down. Oh my god, that's so weird. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh on? <laughs> I'm not moving my arm. Well, I am moving my arm, but like, I'm not trying to move my arm. <laughs> oh, what were we doing? Boxing. Boxing, right. The next step was to research the biokinematics of the human body so that I could program the tense units to train me for my fight. Which muscles are used? When should they be activated? To answer this, we'll study anatomy, physiology, and oh, never mind. Turns out you just have to shock Ow! yourself all over your body, testing different muscles, and write down what happens. These are the four muscles you need for a punch. All right, bicep, so bicep deltoid, first, you know, pec, get the tricep. arm up. And then oh. deltoid to bring your shoulder into the mix. But you can't just Does be doing that. You gotta mix in the pack. So it brings the arm in like that, right? Prime punching position. Then you oh. cancel bicep. I turned it up on accident. You cancel bicep and then hit him with the tricep and bang. <laughs> ah, and it looks like that. It looks like that's it. That's a punch. That's Whoa, slow down there, bucko. Are you turning the dials manually? That's a bit cringe, isn't it? Come on, guy. Let's write some code to automate that. It'll be easy. Start with a little user interface. Just somewhere to customize the timings of your moves. That was easy, right? It only took six, six days. Took a little longer than expected. That's okay. But this is going to need a back end, like a server to talk to the front end. A little library up here. A little post request down here. Now you need another server to process those moves. This server will live on the Raspberry Pi and control the outputs of the tens units based on the move data that it gets from the other server. But then, of course, you need another piece of software to control all of this stuff, right? So the client connect to the tense control server and then the tense control server I literally only heard pi Is this I I I don't I don't understand how You know he edits his own videos too Welcome to coding Dude I wish I wish 
I oh oh no! What did I click? I clicked the oh no! Oh there you go. I wish I was this smart. And it makes me wonder what life would have been like if I didn't have so many brain concussions when I was a child. What could have been? Ew. Right, everything's hooked up. Let's see if it works. Oh, my God. What? What? Oh, the tricep and bicep were firing at the same time. So instead of like doing this or this, it was just locking the arm and the muscles were trying to pull themselves off of my bone. Ow. So we'll make it not do that. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah! Holy fuck! I saw oh, it! Oh, that almost went through the fucking bag. That was crazy. Was five or six kilometers an hour. That was crazy. Yeah! <laughs> yes! <laughs> this is so fucking stupid. I'm gonna be a boxing god. Oh, I'm gonna fucking lose. What the fuck am I saying? <laughs> A little asthma for you, a little J-O-I, if you know what I mean. All right, I hooked up this Xbox controller to be able to control me, and I've been working on this, like, Rock'em Sock'em Robot-type game for, like, a visual indicator. So when the guy punches in the game, it... Uh, but then that got me thinking it would be better for my training if I was fighting someone like in Rock'em Sock'em Robots and it would be cool if you could move the players forward and backwards with a controller like in Rock'em Sock'em Robots but for that we would need two human sized moving platforms on a rail system like this one that I built I could explain how <laughs> pistons and electronics work but the video is getting kind of boring so controller press joystick boring. on controller make <laughs> <laughs> Now, realistically, we'll have someone else controlling us because our arm is going to be strapped and we're going to be punching. <laughs> I'm, tired. I'm going to invite some friends over to test this thing out. I'll probably have to lie to them oh about what it is. Oh my god, that's funny. Who's gullible enough to believe me? Jesus Christ. I said it was a boxing robot. You are oh a boxing robot. Oh my god, you so do. much effort. We're going to have to strap a lot of wires on you. <laughs> How do you make no, Worst case scenario, you step it's down the here and slice your Achilles. Oh, but, that's right. don't do that. You guys are going yeah, at yeah. first. I'm so excited to see how <laughs> this is. Good. Above the chest is like, not good, just he'll heart. <laughs> he'll oh, heart. Like, Which side's the heart on? Left, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's probably fine. <laughs> I think we're ready. Um, oh. Fuck yeah, dude. Okay, uh, controls. Jab is A, and your heavy attack is B. Does the heavy attack hurt them more when you use it? I don't know. Uh, movement. This is, is so dangerous. Analysis. Yeah, so you're controlling. <laughs> Wait, oh my god, the fucking seatbelt exploded. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a seatbelt explode like that before. You guys ready what to do some fighting? You guys ready to train? You gotta train for boxing, right? You can just start fighting. This is not safe. One of you just hit A. Oh, <laughs> uh, is it hurt? Is it hurt? I get her back. I mean, it was like I was possessed. So are you ready for a no, power no, attack? Three, two, one. <laughs> Things are really heating up in the FTX arena. Brought to you by fucking FaZe Clan and Juicero. <laughs> I did a thing versus Boy Boy. Who will come out on top? Three, two, one, fight. God! I I think. This is the best. Like, did he have them sign a waiver or something? This is so dangerous. This is crazy. I can't believe this is real. <laughs> my life. All right, all right, pause. Right. He's crazy. We should make a safe word. I realize we should make a safe word. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. And yeah, there are a couple things to work out, but that's how innovation is done. You're looking at the future of boxing. Oh, this oh. one's really close, actually. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> how do you feel? How do you feel about your boxing form? Well, I liked my left. I yeah. thought you did well on the left. 
You let some good headshots. <laughs> Uh, you're like a boxer, oh, yeah. See, that's what I'm saying. You don't even need to focus on your form when someone else can do it for you. I, I would like to get off this thing, though. Just Understandable. With the machine working better than I ever hoped, it was time for me to try it out. Not being strapped in, it's still incredibly dangerous. Oh. So I'm gonna try the controller. Who wants, that was a good who hit. Wants Michael? I don't want Michael. <laughs> Fucking jab, Nigel! Come on, yeah! Oh. That was a good offense on that. Yeah, right attack. <laughs> no dick shot. Yeah, oh. Dick shot. I'm going for a spear attack. I'm going for a, I'm going for a heavy attack. Yeah! And listen, the controller is awesome, but weirdly they wanted to stop, so it's my turn next. Weirdly. Weirdly. I think it's smart to have a larger opponent so that you're ready for your match. <laughs> oh, what do you mean you press it twice? Huh? You I mean, yeah, you press it. Uh, it's hard to describe what this feels like. It's kind of like a hundred bees working together to control your arm, which is what I assume boxing feels like. So I think this is good uh, practice for my fight. Uh, <laughs> who, 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 who won that round? It looks Holy so painful. Shit. I'm gonna go limp. You got great form there, Michael. This is looking really good. <laughs> <laughs> And with my boxing training nearly complete, it's time to invite over my coach to show him my progress. <laughs> wow! Did you see that? The kiss! Ow! His nose went straight into his invite eye! Over my coach to show him my progress. God! Ow! Ow! <laughs> This is my coach, Michael Quick. He's a professional boxer and has been overseeing my training for the past five months. But with any luck, my machine will phase out the need for a human coach. But then this will like force your muscles to come up. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Clearly terrified of this machine, I'm going to prove its effectiveness to my coach by facing my biggest opponent yet. Coach, I don't know about this one, coach. He's kind of got a lot of height mm. on We're gonna fuck him up. That's true. Go height doesn't mean shit. Height does, in fact, mean shit. <laughs> what the Wait, fuck, coach? Here. What the fuck are I you saw, doing? I know, I know. He can't reach! Yeah. Oh! His I'm biggest the opponent the is Broden. He's getting a hang of the controls. In fact, I'm convinced he forgot that he wasn't playing a video game. Oh shit! You're pressing so many buttons. <laughs> He's on. dying. Oh my god! It took me three hours to edit that. Do you think this is a good training mechanism for boxers? <laughs> Dude, he is so... Michael Reeves is incredible. Not only is he editing his own videos, he's filming and creating code and content like this, but he's also training for an actual real boxing match. No wonder he doesn't stream very much anymore. He's a busy boy. And also filming with OTV. Don't forget, he's part of OTV, so he's, he's also doing videos for them as well. It's crazy. Crazy. That's right. He's so impressed that he can't even summon words. Now it's time to ask him the most important question of all. Do you think I'm ready for Creator Clash? Fuck yeah, dude. Perfect. Because at this point, Creator Clash was only five days away. So I packed my bags, headed to the airport, and got on a flight to Florida. Heh. <laughs> There's supposed to be footage here, but I didn't get any. The thought of the fight was really setting in at this point. I was getting really scared. Like, I've never done anything like that. It's like, it just became so real once I landed that I, I just stopped doing stuff. And the night of the fight came up fast. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to sunny Tampa, Florida. We're Tampa, Florida. For the creator clash. I wasn't really talking to anyone. I was just sitting and watching all the other fights on the TV. And that was making it way worse. I was getting really Oy. nervous. Mine was coming soon, so I started getting warmed up. And I was fully zoned out. Like, I don't know what I was thinking. It didn't really matter. I was, I was up next. So they walked me over to the prep room and I had to get interviewed and warm up the camera and I was just pacing around the room so much, like a goblin. <sighs> I feel better, better than I was Stressful. Earlier. Some of the other fights are scary, but you know, I'm all right. <sighs> but then the guy came in and he walked me over to the arena and then it was time to fight. It's a fine grind, clearing out my cash line, speeding up my ram time. Oh, ow! Oh, oh. Ow! 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 Like oh, God! Did you? It looks so painful. 
Good night, Evelyn. Have a good sleep. That is the face of someone who never has to do boxing ever again. I was so fucking glad for it to be over. And God bless my opponent, my friend Graham, who I know is just as nervous as I was. Still got in the ring and still hit Aww. me in the face a bunch of times. Also, bonus, I won. And yeah, maybe it's because I had a Golden Gloves winning coach come over to my house six times a week and train me. Maybe it's because he made me eat chicken and rice every fucking day. Maybe it's because he made me run up a goddamn mountain every other week. Or maybe it's because he's a great coach and a great friend. Aww. But I'm pretty sure it's because of the boxing robot. Look at this thing. Look how fucking sick this thing looks. Thanks for watching the video. I'm wearing a mask because the garage just flooded and I'm pretty sure there's mold growing in the walls. I wouldn't worry about it. Anyway, if you liked the video, like it. If you didn't, dislike it. It's not like we can see those anymore. And thanks again for watching me box. I am done with boxing forever until the end of eternity, but some say future YouTube boxers are using this breakthrough technology to train, to practice, to prepare for the next <laughs> Creative Clash. Wow! What a great video. Um, oh gosh, I, I was tra I trained with a trainer. I did boxing for a, uh, uh, a few months. It was incredible. I loved it a lot. But I just don't think I can commit the time to put in to train properly towards boxing. And I also am so afraid of getting more brain damage. I feel like I don't have many cells left to lose. Oh, oh, keep watching. Okay. There's more, there's more. Thank you for waiting so long. Oh, right in the cack. Pokey said she wouldn't do it because she'd commit too hard and do steroids. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> that's the thing. Like, if I were to commit to something like this, I would not be streaming. I would. I would not be living with my roommates because I cannot be in a house that has the snackies that are, are held in this household. I would literally have to like live by myself. No, no temptations, no distractions. I wouldn't work on any other projects. I would literally like, I, I would dial in boxing only, clean food only. I would work out every single day. I just like, I can't, I cannot do that. Cannot do that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm